And at 7 o'clock, we start with the latest out of Ukraine as the war with Russia raging on. Overnight, a Russian missile hit Kharkiv, Ukraine's second largest city. And at this hour, we are getting our first look at the moment that missile hit. Ron is in the newsroom with the video and the latest details at this hour. Ron. Even though we know there's a war going on, it's still shocking video to see the video and the aftermath. The missile hitting right in the town's central square, a large government building. We want to warn you, uh, some people might find that very image right there disturbing. And so those are the images as the missile hit. And as you can see, it's very difficult to, in fact, make out. It was the middle of the day, got a car driving by. Other vehicles uh, were badly damaged. Here we are one more time. There's the missile and the strike that it makes on that building and then the explosion. This is the headquarters of the regional administration in Kharkiv. And this happened just in the last few hours. Still not clear if anybody was killed. Six people were hurt, including one child. And now, here is video of the aftermath of the attack. Firefighters sifting through the rubble. You can see the damage to the building was significant. It's hard to believe that there won't be a sizable death toll to report as the day goes on. It comes as Ukraine's president is accusing Moscow of resorting to terror tactics and war crimes. Meanwhile, that large military convoy continues to edge ever closer to Kiev, 40 miles. You have troop transport vehicles, you have tanks, and you have a lot of support vehicles as well, making you think that the Russians are digging in for a long fight. Now, all this comes after a first round of talks really yielded no results, but both sides agreed to meeting in the coming days. Ukraine is reporting 136 civilian deaths so far, including 13 children. Guys, as the developments continue to come in, we will keep you updated here in the newsroom. Thank you, Rob.